The Otis Company built a new 29-story skyscraper without offices to test what two types of personal transportation systems? Elevator and an escalator. What building material consists of sun-dried mud bricks reinforced with straw? Could you repeat that, please? What building material consists of sun-dried mud bricks reinforced with straw? What building material? Um, bricks block that they build pyramids with. What cheese is typically found on Greek salads? Pass. What is the name of the German scientist who is immortalized by the gas burner in every science lab? Bunsen burner. What the Columbia River begins in Columbia Lake in what Canadian province? Pass. What cheese is typically found on Greek salads? Uh, cheddar. The Columbia River begins in Columbia Lake in what Canadian province? Toronto. Time. All right, Robert, how'd you do? Uh, I'd say 75%. All right, hold on. Someone helping you? Kind of like, like blatantly. Radio up. Is what it was. I think it was radio up. Yeah. Yeah, because I heard the repeat of him ah. saying, "Can you repeat the question?" Yeah. That probably doesn't help. No. No. Hot wings is back. Hi. Welcome back. Headphones going on. And now it is your turn to play. Feel any rust after taking a week off? Um, yeah, a little bit. Do you have a, a newfound sense of pressure? No. Well, you should. <laughs> the time is now. Uh, your turn, Hot Wings, begins in three, two, one. The Otis Company built a new 29-story skyscraper without offices in order to test what two types of personal transportation systems? Elevators and escalators. What building material consists of sun-dried mud bricks reinforced with straw? Adobe. What cheese is typically found on Greek salads? Feta. What is the name of the German scientist who Im is immortalized by the gas burners in every science lab? Uh, Dr. Bunsen. The Columbia River begins in Columbia Lake in what Canadian province? Uh, British Columbia. Time. Robert, welcome back. Let's score this game. All right. The Otis Company built a new 29-story skyscraper without offices in order to test what two types of personal transportation systems. Having said elevators and escalators, as did Robert, both correct. Tied at one. What building material consists of sun-dried mud bricks reinforced with straw? Having said adobe. Robert said a lot of word salad and then finished with pyramid blocks. The answer is adobe. <laughs> Two to one. What cheese <laughs> is typically found on Greek salads? Hot wings said feta. Robert said cheddar. It is feta. Three to one hot wings. What is the German scientist's name who was immortalized by the gas burner in every science lab? You both said Dr. Bunsen. Both correct. Robert Bunsen, for the record, 4-2. to two. The Columbia River begins in Columbia Lake. In what Canadian province? Hot Wings said British Columbia. Robert said Toronto. Okay. Troublesome. The answer is British Columbia. 5-2. No rust on these hinges. No way, man. That's good. Sorry, Robert. I was an unstoppable force today. Knowing yeah, things like elevators and cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Real strong points for you. Yeah. Robert, thank you for listening. We appreciate it. Hope you get back to work soon, okay? Okay, thank you. All right, bud. Derp, derp, derp.